Hello everyone, VJ from 21D. A question we get asked quite often is, what is fully guided surgery? Well, let me explain its importance. When I started doing implants a very long time ago, nearly three decades ago, what we'd have to do to place these implants, we didn't have this level of visualization technology. I'd have to numb a patient up. I'd have to look at a 2D x-ray, which isn't accurate one-to-one -one representation of the patient. I'd then actually have to take out all their teeth, numb them up, open the gum, and then go hunting for the best site before I started. Today, technology is so advanced that I can take these scans and I can do a virtual surgery and I can plan the positions. Once I've planned the positions, I can actually 3D print in our bioengineering division a guide that will fit you perfectly and I can deliver those implants to within a hundred micron accuracy of where I've planned. Apart from the fact that it's a lot less traumatic for the patient, it's much faster than freehand and it's very predictable in the positions. Because one of the things that needs to be understood is the position of the implants is all well and good, but can you put the teeth on please? But the position of the implants in relation to the new teeth that are going on is even more important because what we need to calculate is the optimal balance of compromises between the bone, the implant, and the new prosthesis. Having these come out in the perfect position in this prosthetic, can you eliminate the lower one and can I have an occlusal view, please? If you have a look, no, no, not too much, stop. If you have a look, they come out in the middle of the prosthetic. This is very, very, very important because then the engineering of the actual prosthesis itself is far more integral. If we didn't use a guide, then we could end up with implant positions over here, over there, over there, coming out that way. These are suboptimal positions. So it's very important that we have the optimal positions of the implants and to achieve that, we have to use surgical guides for this level of precision consistently. Thank you.